Once there was a boy who was feeling quite blue. You can't feel blue, that's a colour. Okay, but shh, shh, just, just be quiet. So he climbed up a tree, as he would tend to do. Ooh, that's high. And up in that tree, he thought through things like why. Why what? It, it, it's complicated. Oh, 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 okay. And while he was thinking, something caught his eye. I caught a fish once. Uh, great. It looked quite a bit orange and covered with fur. So he climbed on down and thought he'd explore. Oh, I like exploring. So he walked and walked and walked some more. That's a lot of walking. Wondering what for him was in store. Till he found it right there, a pile of orange fur. And then all of a sudden, it started to stir. Like a pudding? No, 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 it just, it just, it just moved, just, it, yeah. He didn't know whether to stay or to go. Then the orange thing made a big noise. Hello! The thing was called Merv and they got to talk about this and about that and how antelopes walk. Wait, wait, wait a second, this is a story of how we met. So what did you learn from that story? Well, I learnt that climbing a tree can be good for when you feel down, but nothing beats having a good friend around. Oh, that's, that's lovely. Although you've got to be very careful climbing trees. I didn't see your parents supervising. Well, yeah, okay, great, thank you. And, you've got to be careful talking to strangers. I know it worked out okay in this story, but I'd hate for people to get the wrong message. And one more thing, referring to yourself in the third person isn't as clever as you think it is. Again, thank you very much.